when I wrote um, Heartbeat Here, I wrote it in just like a sitting. Like I sat down for, for 45 minutes and I had a song. And it's, it's almost like unfair, like you think about these songs that you have, or I do, where I've spent like weeks or maybe months like just, just like hammering on a song. And by rights, those ought to be the ones that are like better, but they're not at all. They never are. It's the ones that just kind of just really arrive nearly fully formed. And you, it sounds a little artsy to, to say you feel like you're just like the conduit for it or something, but that is what it feels like. Is that why with this, with this album, you said that um, when, as soon as you wrote a song, you recorded it that day. Is yeah. that to kind of capture that feeling? Yeah, I thought that um, when you, when if you're lucky enough that the song arrives in that way, you you, you better get out of its way, you better hurry up and and record it, and um, and I I was okay knowing that it would not be the most perfect performance I would ever give of these songs. I wanted it to be the most connected performance I'd ever given of these songs. So I'd, I'd write the song, and the distance from my couch to my studio is this width. And, in the basement. And, uh, in the basement, and so that's where I would, uh, I don't know if I lost anything in the walk, but it didn't feel like it did. And, and Well, it doesn't sound like it did either, that's, that's for sure. Um, I'm going to kind of modify one of your questions which referenced Taylor Swift. <laughs> I read recently that you would never turn down a call from Taylor Swift for a collaboration. That's true. Would you? What? Would any of you guys turn it down? <laughs> no. <laughs> just, just throwing it out there. Um, is, is there a dream collaboration that kind of lives in your head? Any artist dead or alive? Um, th I mean, there's a... There's a uh, I'd love to collaborate with Amy Shark. Sure. I'd love to collaborate with AC Musgraves. I'd with like um, love to be with something with Taylor one day. Um, We're going to talk this into existence. <laughs> I mean, the thing is, you know, she's she's a pal, and I never have wanted. And she's been really kind and vocal about the fact that she likes our band, and that's carries a lot of weight, you know. Um. um Pretty much my last one, because you guys were really lame on the question you asking. <laughs> if anybody it. suddenly has something urgent they would like to ask, let me know. Um, you end your shows a certain way uh, with a certain song, hands down, usually. I mm. mean, we haven't been tonight yet. But, um, you haven't? No, we haven't, we haven't made it there yet. <laughs> me neither. That's good. <laughs> Is that moment the same for you every time? Like, Does it feel special every time you? Yeah, but it's it not happens? the same. Yes, it's special. But it's never the same. It's kind of along the lines you were asking, like if you were, could you, could you become tired of one of your songs? But the truth is that you guys are there. You're the difference makers for these songs. If I were to just play them in my living room, I'd, I'd have stopped playing them a long time ago. But there's a different resonance with the crowd's participation each night. It's different than any other night there's ever been. It's like a living thing. Um, and so it's, a, it's an extraordinary feeling, that one in particular, but many of them where you, you feel the song get swept out of your hands and taken over by the rest of the band, which is out there. I love it. That moment tonight. Tears. Yeah, yeah. we're not going to play it tonight, though. <laughs> we're going to skip it. <laughs> All right, well, I... Think one more. Okay, so I know just since you were talking about heartbeat, uh, you were t we were talking about heartbeat here, and we were talking about hands down. I'll, I'll just say that there's this correlation between the two is it, that's touching to me because hands down kind of fell in my life, and so did heartbeat here, and they're about the same thing. And I'd never expected to write like an another direct story about. This life experience. As a matter of fact, I've resisted. But it showed up. 